Hello everybody, we're going to start in a few minutes. class we are going to be working again with daily routines and we are going to be working on the manual pages from page 24 to page 26 Hello, Andres. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you tonight? Fine. And um, today, man, I connect this the cell phone, the computer. <laughs> no, here. <laughs> okay, it didn't work. Uh, this actualized. Uh, no, arranca. Oh, that's a problem. That's a big problem. Ya lleva como una hora. Yeah. That happens when you update. Yes, update. Remember, that's the word. Update. Update. Yeah, it has happened to me. In my case, because I am working, uh, I need to be prepared. I got the one that I'm working in, and I got backup. Okay. I have a backup. Yes. If something happens, I jump from one to the other one. Uh, yeah. I and um, and sell a uh, new PC on a laptop. Oh. Pero ahorita estoy ahorrando para ver si me la compro. Yeah. Yeah, you know, uh, well, you got classmates from Valdez. Sí, cabal, ahí le dije aquel día a uh, uh, Julio. Yeah. Que voy a mandar a información. Good product. Mm -hmm. Very good product. Yes. Le dije que una de las tres B. Yeah, I know, I know what you mean. <laughs> Yeah, actually, I mean, you can get, they got some acceptable. I got an i7, yes. mine is a Dell i7. And yeah. for what I do, it's okay. And I bought it. My from computer is, computer. I buy. I3, yes. Computer. My computer is i3. i3 is good. I mean, it depends on the generation. Yes. You can have a nice seven, but if it's like second, third generation, it's slower than an i3 yes. seven generation. 
for example. Hey, look, there's Mayra. Mayra, hello. Hello. Good Mayra. evening. Good evening. How are Good you? Good evening, Mayra. How are you? We're fine. Are you motivated for today? A few days ago, I saw you like, hmm. A few days ago, I saw you like, hmm. A little tired. <laughs> Uh, I can imagine, I can imagine. And how do you feel with the class, Mayra? <laughs> ¿Cómo siente la clase? Le oigo como entrecortado, teacher. How do you feel the class? Oh, fine. Fine? That's great, fine. that's great. Remember, yes. any question, let me know. I can't set up a special time. Cualquier duda, ya sabe, puedo agregarla. Sí. Tengo puntos extra todos los miércoles. And what about okay. the platform? Are you working on the platform, guys? ¿Estamos trabajando en la plataforma? Yes, teacher. Yes. Tomorrow, I will check it out. Uh, section 2 and I will upload grades. Mañana voy a revisar la sección 2 y voy a poner notas. Okay. So, it is important for you to have it. Remember, the, the goal is to get the 100%. La meta es llegar al 100%. That's the idea. Hello, Ileana. How are you? Este, yes, cuando sir. se hace... Tell me, Mayra. Teacher, cuando se hace, digamos, la, la tarea en, en la plataforma, me aparece ahí, ¿verdad? Que, que de enviar las respuestas. Pero cuando yo la vuelvo a ver, es como que si no, o sea, no están contestadas, no sé. Ah, Pero connect. sí me aparece un chequecito verde. Ok. Next time you do it, let me know. Let's see, let's see, let me see. You are Mayra, ¿no? Yes. Let me see if you give me a few seconds. Uh, I will check because I have access. I have access and I can check it out. So if there's something, perhaps I can help you. If you are having problems with the platform, I can report it. Mm. So don't worry, I mean, we can help you with that. And right now it is logging in. Let me see. We are uh, English beginners level one. Yeah, but don't worry, I mean, we can work on that. Let's see, there's Ileana. Hello, Ileana, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you tonight? Ready for class? Uh, very good, teacher. Excellent, that's the attitude. That's great. I envy Ileana. I know that she's got the fun very close because I can see her hair move. I can, I mean, Mayra, I can see her hair moving. Me da envidia, veo que hasta le mueve el cabello. The fan, el ventilador, that's great. That's great because today is a hot day. Yes, very hot. Yeah, and it doesn't look like if it's going to rain. Y no pareciese que va a llover. So let's see, Andres, tell me, how was today for you? How was your day? Fine. Um, very quiet. And still uh, I have a call with 
clients. Okay. Uh, so you are working from home? No. You went to I work. home. Uh, yes, the working in office. Okay, just let me see. Let me see, and I'm checking uh, uh, um, something here. You are Mayra Lisset Valladares. In the case of Mayra Lisset Valladares, I am checking in the platform. And I don't see you, Mayra. Where are you? Perhaps in the second page. Mayra Lisset, well, in the first one you got a hundred. In the second one you got 60. So that means that you have done Three homeworks. I hecho tres tareas, Mayra. From second week. Yes? I don't hear you. Yes, yes. Okay. So we are okay right now, Mayra. In your case, all your grades are perfect. So you are just missing today, okay. homework and tomorrow. Solo le falta la tarea de hoy y mañana. Mm -hmm. Okay, whenever you have Thanks. any problem, let me know because I can check it. Cuando tengan problemas o no estén seguros cómo van con las tareas, let me know, I can check it. Yo puedo revisar también. Okay, let's see. There's uh, Carla, there's Marco, there's Erika, oh, Jenny, and Anna. Great to see hello. you. Hello. Hi, Anna. How are hello. you? Hello, hello. Good night. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> well, no. Okay, let's see. Jenny, hi, how are you? Very fine, thank you, teacher. Oh, great, that's nice. Tell me, Jenny, how was your day? i <clears throat> very tired. You're tired? Why? See, I have worked. Okay, today from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Ouch, a long mm -hmm. day, very long day. Yeah. Un muy largo día. Así que I was eating. Okay. <laughs> yeah. no entraba. Uh -huh. Okay, I understand that. Yeah, let's see. Hey, Marcos, welcome. Great to see you today. Oh, teacher. Good How night. are you? Yesterday you were very busy. Ayer estuvo ocupado, me dijeron. Yes, uh, working mucho. A lot, a lot. A lot, yes. working a lot. Remember, when you say mucho, you can say a lot. Okay. Okay, let's see. There's Erica. Hi, Erica. How are you? Hi. I'm fine. Um, a long day. You had a long day? I can imagine. But ready for class? What? Ready for class? Yes. Great. Excellent. Well, let's see. We got, uh, oh, there's Carla. Hello, Carla. Hello, teacher, everybody. Please, Carla, tell me that's a cup of coffee. Don't tell me at all. <laughs> Please. I like <laughs> coffee, coffee, Carla. Coffee is vitamin. That's a good vitamin. Okay. Let's... Delicious. Yeah, I love my coffee black. And I love, I do love espresso. Me too. Me too. Uh, I love espressos. I can have two espressos on a row. One. No, I can have two on a row. On a row, that means uh, what we say in Spanish, seguido. That's on a row. So in my case, I can say... Me da energía. No, in my case, actually, it relaxes me. 
Sometimes I take a cup of coffee around midnight before going to sleep. A veces tomo uno around midnight before going to sleep, antes de ir a dormir, so I can sleep peacefully. It's great for me. So let's see. Hello, Carlos. Thank you, Carla. Hello, Carlos. How are you? Hello. Uh, hello. Uh, good, good evening. Uh, that's good. That's good. Hello. How are you tonight? Everything fine? Everything good? Hey, good. Good. Yes. Nice. Hey, there's Vicente. Hi, Vicente. How are you? Hi. Very tired. Tired? But very good and ready for class. That's excellent. That's the attitude, man. I like yes. that. A good attitude is very important. Okay, guys, let's see. Today, believe it or not, we are going to continue talking about daily routines. Because the idea is that at the end of the week, you are able to talk about your own routines and somebody else's routines in a very simple and fast way. If you got your manuals, today we are going to be covering pages uh, 24, 25, and 26 from the manual, okay? Today we are going to work three pages from the manual. Hoy trabajaremos con tres páginas del manual, 24, 25, 26, okay? That's very important because, I mean, in every single class we see like normal, regular vocabulary, but this is also English for work. So you need to get vocabulary related to your job. I mean, this is, this is English for the trabajo. You don't need just the normal everyday vocabulary. No necesitan simplemente vocabulario todos los días. You also need a vocabulary related to what you do. Necesitan también vocabulario acerca de lo que hacen. Your occupations. And that's why the program, the manual, focus, the manual focus exactly in that. Okay, by the way, with this word, be very, very careful. Okay, focus, focus. The thing is that we Latin speakers sometimes mispronounce that word. Los latinos a veces pronunciamos mal esa palabra. It's focus, okay? Focus. Yes, so today we are going to be focusing exactly on vocabulary related to your jobs. So, hey, there's Cesar. Hello, Cesar, how are you? Hello, everybody, I'm fine. Great, great. Cesar, remind me, please, next week to reschedule for the one-on-one -on -one sessions. Me recuerdo la próxima semana de retomarlo para las sesiones uno a uno. Yesterday yes, I just okay. had two persons. Thanks. Ayer solo tuve a dos de ustedes. There was just Andres and Claudia. And I mean, I have extra time. I will stay every Wednesday from 10 to 11. So I have extra time if you got any doubt, if you need any help or tips or whatever help you need with the English, I'm here for you. So you can connect, you can let me know so I can schedule there and we can have time to have a conversation perhaps if you need to improve, if you want exercises, extra exercises, if you do not understand a specific topic, anything you want from the related to English, not just the class, you can ask me and we can talk about it. Okay, so let's see. There's 12 of us right now, and we are going to start. Let's see if anybody has reported. Let me see, please. I am checking out, I'm sorry, I'm checking out if anybody else has reported yet. Okay. Perfect, no, just a meeting, but it's not with me. Okay, let's see. Uh, Carla, tell me, do you have meetings every day? Do 
Do you Hello? Have, do you have meetings every day? Do you know the word meetings? Yes. Monday and Saturday. Okay. Are there personal meetings or are you meeting online? Personal. Okay, so you have to be present there. How long are your meetings? How long? One hour, two hours, three hours? Mm, two hours. If you are not sure, you can say around, around two hours or around three hours. Alrededor. Two hours. Okay. So tell me, and what do you do on those meetings? Do you present reports? Mm, I have, I make inventories. Okay. You make inventory. Inventories. Okay. Remember, look at me, look at me, Carla. Inventory. Inventory. In Perfect. I receive, I receive mm -hmm. merchandise. Uh, merchandise. 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 I okay. receive merchandise. Okay, great. Excellent. Remember something? Father, yes, tell me, tell me. Tell me, Carla. My father is... Your father is... A teacher. Oh, great. So, remember, Carla, when you are speaking in English, letter O, well, we are beginners. Estamos como principiantes. So, letter O, try to make it a little bit rounder, 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 okay? Letter O. Yes? Like you say, report. You see? The letter R, remember, la R, recuerden, your tongue goes back. Merchandise, merchandise. Report. Merchandise. Meetings, meetings, okay? The, when you pronounce a sound as an R, your tongue goes backwards. Cuando pronunciamos un sonido como R, su lengua va hacia atrás, okay? Any question? No? Okay, great. So let's see, Andre, uh, Andres, tell me, what about you? Do you have meetings regularly, frequently? Um, no. Uh, me, I not uh, meeting that office, uh, but uh, my partners, uh, Yes, I'm meeting uh, with the boss. Okay, so you don't have that problem. You don't have that problem of having meetings. Great. No. Excellent. Wow, I envy you. I got many meetings. And in my case, it's complex because I have, let me see, one, two, let me see, one, two, three, four, four jobs, four different jobs. Tengo cuatro trabajos distintos. So I have meetings from all of them along the week. So in my case, it's like uh, very stressful because yeah. I, have, I have to prepare, yeah, I have to prepare reports from different, from different uh, classes and stuff like that. Okay, let's see. Uh, what about you, Cesar? Do you have meetings? Yes, yes, I am. I have meetings with my clients. Okay. Uh, the my meetings uh, uh, duran, como se dice duran. Oh, excellent, excellent. It's this word. Look, last. Last. Uh, my okay, meeting my meeting lasts around 
lasts around uh, 30 minutes. Okay. 30 minutes or one hour. Okay. One hour. You can say my meetings last from half an hour to one hour. You can say from two. Yes. And remember, you can say 30 minutes or you can say half an hour. Half, half, half an, an hour. hour. That's media hora. Okay. Half an hour okay. means exactly that 30 minutes. Okay. Hey, there's Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Hi. How are you? Good evening. Good evening. I'm fine, thank you. Uh, and you? We are fine here. Glad to have you. Tell me, Jennifer, how was your day? Con mucha actividad, what do you say? With many activities. With many activities. Oh. What uh, did you do? Inspection and okay. meetings and capacitation. Oh, 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 look, look. That word, what you mean is training. 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 Look at me, look training. at me. Training. Training. Perfect. Excellent. So you have also, you got meetings, you got trainings. Wow, that, so you had a heavy day. And do the report. And do reports. Report. Do reports. Perfect, excellent. What about you, Erika? Erika, your microphone. Sorry. Oh, uh, I don't know in the meeting. Uh, we are ready in the company. Okay. So, not too, not too much problem with that. No tanto problema con eso. Great. No. Excellent. Uh, uh, personal, the uh, inside. Yes. In the company. Okay. Estamos atendiendo personal del mensaje. So, we attend personal from We attend staff. personal from the mensaje. Okay, great. Excellent. 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 So, let's see. Okay. What about you, Jenny? Tell me. Do you usually have meetings? Yes, I have meetings. With my boss. Okay. How regularly? Every day? Uh, uh, two, two weeks. Every two weeks? Tw oh, twice a week. Oh, twice a week. A week. Uh, Remember, the expression is... is... Yes, I know what you mean. You are saying twice. I'm sorry. Twice. Twice a week. Twice. Twice a week. Twice a week. That's to say two times. Two times in one week. We say twice. Twice a week. Twice. Okay. Or you can say twice per week. It's exactly the same. Es exactamente lo mismo. Twice per week. Okay. Per week. Okay. okay. Okay, let's see. How do you say, uh, how do you say un día sí, un día no, in English? Does anybody know? Alguien sabe? No. Okay, that's easy. Look, I will text it for you. You say it? Every other day. When you say every other day, you are saying 
One day yes, one day no, another day yes, another one no. Okay? You go like yes, no, yes, no, that's every other day. Like uh, Caesar tells me, hey, I, I shave every other day. That means that he shaves today, not tomorrow, but the day after tomorrow, he does. Okay? That's the way we use it. And not just with day. You can say every other week, every other month. You can use it like that. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's continue. I am using vocabulary because we need, we are going to talk about this vocabulary we are, I am presenting to you. Okay? So, uh, let's see. Marcos. Hello, Marcos. Tell me, Marcos, do you have to attend clients? Tiene que atender clientes? Or, uh, yes, teacher. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, remember, yes, I do, no, I don't. Today we are going to reinforce that. Ahora vamos a reforzar ese tema also. Okay? So, okay. do you have many clients during the day? Many? Muchos? Um, no. Not really. No. Okay. We, we can say no or we can say no really and that means like mm, no but you go like not really mm. it means not that much cuando decimos esa expresión not really we mean like no tanto no mucho okay? okay according to the context remember that's according to the context hey look we are getting a lot of vocabulary today Estamos viendo mucho vocabulario este día. That's good. I know you like to get new vocabulary. Let's see. Customers. Okay, let's see. Who of you is in the customer service area? I know that Andres is in the customer service, no? Because you are in sales. So he's in the customer service area. Who else is in customer service? Let's see, Carla is in the SRF, yes. Inventories and stuff like that, so she's not in customer. And let's see, this Cesar. Yes, yeah, Cesar has to meet with clients. And Jenny also has to attend clients, no? Yes. Okay, so you have to attend, you don't say clients that much. You can also say customers, okay? Remember, that word refers to the same. When you say customers, you are saying clients. ¿Es lo mismo o es diferente? No, you are saying the same. Just the, the difference is this. When you are in the, I mean, a customer is someone who goes and buy a product, okay? A client is somebody who goes and buy a product or a service. You get the idea? Remember guys, when you say customer, you are referring that Somebody goes and buy a product. Cuando decimos customer, the persona va y compra un producto. But when you say client, the person can also be buying a service. Like I mean, if I go to the to the barber shop, te voy a la barbería, I am a client. Okay? But if I go to the supermarket, I am a customer. Si voy al supermercado, soy un customer. Because in the barber shop, they were providing a service. 
en la barbería me estaban dando un servicio. But in the supermarket, I am getting a product, something that I get and take home. Algo que yo tomo y me llevo. You see the difference? Yes. Okay. And remember, client can be both. Recuerden, client can be applied for both. Cliente se puede aplicar para ambos. Either if you are buying a service or a product. Indiferentemente si usted compra un servicio o un producto. Customer, you are buying a product. Specifically. Mientras que si usted dice customer, es quien compra específicamente el producto. Are we clear? Yes? Clear. Perfect. Remember, we are... Teacher, yes, teacher. tell me, Andres. This is uh, with, uh, with the target. The customer is the with a uh, target. Or target. Target. Um, the customers are only 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 con, uh, buy and product. Yes. Only product. Yes. Uh, uh, the client. Well, uh, client. The client is uh, both. A client puede ser cosa. ambas cosas. Okay. The product or the service. But if you say customer, you are being specific. Si usted dice customer, está siendo específico. It's somebody who goes and buy a product. I mean, if... Ah, por, if por le decía, target, igual que el, que el target. Uh, yes. Porque if, lo tiene así, específico. Imagine that, uh, let's see, Carla wants to do her hair. Imagine that Carla wants to do her hair. Okay. Oops, hair. I'm sorry. I, I misspelled something here. But, and she goes to, she goes to Ileana for her service. So she can help her. Y va donde Ileana que le ayude. Carla is Ileana's client. Because Ileana is a stylist. So in this case, in this specific case, she is not a customer. She is a client. Got it? En este caso específico, si Carla va a que Ileana uh, le haga el cabello, she is not a customer. Is a client. You see the difference? Questions? No. Okay, fine. Let's continue. Let's see. Part of what we are going to be working on today. Let me see. Let's see. Okay. Remember, we are in page 24 and we are talking about daily here are some sentences. Remember, I told you, we were going also to work with yes, no questions in simple present. Like, do I get up early? Do you call other companies? Do they transport the product? Do we check the policies? Remember, when we are making a question, the auxiliary, do or does, go at the beginning because we are asking yes, no question. And what are the short answers? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, you don't. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Yes, we do. No, we don't. In this case, we are using short answers. Okay. Now, we have here some sentences. We have here vocabulary to make a sentence. Like in number one, let's see. Uh, Carla, are you around? Yes. Yes? Do you, no, do you work company? Do you work for a company? In a company. For a company. Okay. Now, Carla, in this case, remember, what about if I ask you this question? Carla, tell me, do you work for a company? What would be the answer? Answer to me, please. Uh, 
I'm asking you, do you work for a company? Yes or no? Yes, I do. Perfect, excellent. That's the answer. Remember, short answer, because the question is not sad. I am not asking for which company. No le estoy preguntando por qué company. Por qué compañía. I'm just asking you, do you work for a company? And she says, oh, yes, I do. It's like, Jenny, do you work for a company? Yes, I do. Okay. It's different if I come and ask Carla again. Carla, what company do you work for? I work in Valdez. Look at the question. What company do you work for? So you have to say, I work for Valdez. Okay? You gotta be careful with those little nuances. Tenemos que ser cuidadosos con esos detallitos. Okay? Because remember, actually the questions, both questions are the same. And the answers are the same. Y las respuestas ambas lo mismo. What she said to me, I work in Valdez is the same as I work for Valdez. Now, what's the difference? The difference is that uh, I work I work in Inglés Corporativo, but I work for Insafor. What's the difference? You can be in a company, but not being hired for the company. Why? Because now it's very common to see uh, this little word that we use a lot, outsourcing. Do you know what is the outsourcing? Conocemos lo que es el outsourcing? It's like, uh, like, you know, the people who in some companies, perhaps in your company, they hire another company for the people who do the cleaning. A veces las compañías contratan a otra compañía para que les haga la limpieza. Does it happen in your company, Carla? Or is the same company, the personal? Present company. Okay. What about oh, in the banks? You know, in the banks, they hire some other people for the cleaning. Los bancos tienen un personal aparte que es el de limpieza. Or securities. So, they work perhaps in the Vivienda Bank, but they don't work for the Vivienda. They work for the other company. That's the difference. So, in the first question, I was asking, what company do you work for? Okay? The little word at the end, for, makes a difference. Okay? It's not the same to uh, what company do you work in? You see the difference? When you say what company do you work for is who pays you? ¿Quién le paga? What company do you work in? Perhaps you are an outsource. Quizás usted sea parte del outsourcing. So perhaps you are hired for another company to provide the service. Okay? Uh, is that getting clear to you? Estoy siendo claro or we are like, mm, not that clear. Yes? Or so so. So so. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see, let's see. The the security guys. Los tipos de seguridad in the supermarket. Everybody goes to the supermarket, no? No, no in the supermarket. Uh, the security guys from the from the drugstores, the pharmacies. Los chicos de seguridad de las farmacias. 
They work for a company that provides the security. Ellos trabajan para la compañía que provee la seguridad. They don't work for the pharmacy. No trabajan para la farmacia. Okay? So, they work for the security company, but they are assigned in a pharmacy. Pero están asignados en una farmacia. That's the difference. So when you when I ask her, what company do you work for? In the case of Carla, she should have told me, I work for Valdez. Okay? She's being specific. Está siendo específica. Okay? So Cesar, what company do you work for? I work for PIB Inversiones. Okay, what do they do? What? What Repeat, do they do? Uh, I am a... Bueno, they, 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 uh, they. Perfect. <laughs> they are industrial company. Okay. They industrial are... equipment. 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 Okay. They sell the equipment or they service the equipment? Uh, sales the, the equipment. Okay. Do you know that expression? To service the equipment? Yes. 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 When, when we uh, say... The, the service too. Okay, so we, we, we service a me, mechanica, mechanics. Mechanical? Machinery? Mechanical. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, mechanical machinery. Okay, perfect. In this case, everybody, when I say, do they service, that means that do they provide maintenance? Le dan mantenimiento. When another company comes and they do the maintenance to a machine, cuando ellos llegan y le dan el mantenimiento a una máquina, we can say that they are servicing or that they service the equipment. Okay? Like uh, Excel Automotriz, they service cars. Because what do they do is change the oil, change parts, and they also sell the parts. So they sell the parts and they service the cars. Okay? Are we clear up to now? Vamos bien con el vocabulario? Yes? Excellent. Great. Remember, today's class is vocabulary practice, actually. El nombre de esta clase es vocabulary practice. So that's why we are focused on vocabulary. Okay, let's continue, guys. Uh, as you remember, we were working with the manual. So we are going to continue with the manual. Let's see, question number two, Jenny, please. Okay. Can you see, can you make the question for me? ¿Puedo hacerme la pregunta? Eh, eh, do or does? They, ah, ok. Do. Do. Yes. Do they check for the product? product? Do they <laughs> check product? And the question in this case says, the answer says, eh, no. No. They, uh, they don't. They don't. Perfect. Excellent. Just like that. Erika, are you around? <clears throat> Erika, hello. Hola. Hello, Erika. Do you see question number three? Yes. 
lo veo borroso. Ok, no problem, no problem. Let's see who else can help me. Uh, Vicente, can you help me, please? Do we list any customers? Okay, perfect. And the answer is? Yes? Yes, we do. Perfect. Now, here, a little something for you guys. When we use the verb listen, always, always, all the time, it is listen to. Listen to. Perfect, Vicente. Excellent. Remember, you listen to music. You listen to people. Right now, you listen to me. Okay? Always it is listen to. The verb is not just listen. It's Listen to. ¿Ok? Este verbo nunca se escribe simplemente listen. It's listen to. And something else. In this case, the letter T, la letra T, no sound. You don't say listen. You say listen. Listen. ¿Ok? Listen. Like, listen to me. The same happens when you are saying internet. We don't say internet or internet. Well, that perhaps in Spanish, but in English you say internet. Okay? We say mount, mount. In this, in the case of the word montaña. The T is very, very short. Mount. You almost don't hear it. Casi no se oye. Mount. Okay. Let's continue. Let's see. Now it's for uh, Jennifer. Can you help me with number four? Doesn't. Does. Mm, look at the subject. It's I. Do? Uh, it, number five. Uh -huh. Do. Do I, I? Do I buy new material? Material. Buy. Material. The answer, please. No, I don't. No, I don't. Uh, no, I don't. Remember, remember. Okay. Do I buy new material? Do I buy new material? Okay? That's the way we pronounce it. Do I buy new material? Now, let's see. Do I buy... Mm, next one. Mayra, you ready? Mayra is ready for next one. Number five. We have teacher. Yes. One Do. question. Yes, tell me. Uh, for question, ask where. No, you don't. Or no, or no, I don't. No, it depends. Do I buy new material? It depends. If I'm asked, if I'm, if it's a rhetoric answer, it could be no, I don't. If you are answering me, it's no, you don't. It depends on the conversation. If you are, if, if you come and tell me, uh, do you have to buy material? And I'm like, do I buy material? Mm, no, I don't. But if you're asking me, hey, do you buy new material? It's I can say, logo. no, I don't. Or if I ask you, do I buy material? You tell me, no, you don't. Like imagine that you hire me. Imagínese que usted me contrata. Y yo le digo, hey, mister, do I buy the material? And you say, oh, no, you don't. We provide it. It varies according okay. to context. Varía de acuerdo al contexto. Sorry, Mayra, I haven't forgotten you. Okay. No le he olvidado. 
Let's continue. Okay. Milena and Pablo, no. do, do Milena and Pablo design to Design, logo? design. Design. Do Milena and Pablo design to logo? Design logo. Just like logo. that. Or logos. The answer, please. No. Yes. Yes. They do. Yes, they do. Perfect. Excellent, Mayra. Well done. Yes. Teacher, a uh, question. Tell me. The, the answer the the answer can say the name of the persons. Uh, for yes, example, Milena and Pablo. Yes, yes uh, Milena and Pablo do. Yes. If you puede? are if you are emphasizing, yes. Sí, si te va a enfatizar los nombres de la persona, sí. Like, uh, do, do Ileana and Erika uh, work with her? And you tell me, oh, yes, Ileana does. Erika does. It. You see? You are emphasizing. Mm -hmm. It's like uh, you can use, there's something that I haven't told you, but you can actually use the auxiliary in the affirmative form. Esto no es algo que les haya dicho, pero sí podemos utilizar el auxiliar en la forma afirmativa. Only if we are really, really trying to emphasize something. Solo si de veras, de veras, de veras queremos enfatizar algo. Like, uh, if I say, Mm, you know what? Anna, Anna does work in class. I am emphasizing. Estoy como diciendo, Anna, sí, de veras, trabaja en clase. Anna does work in class. Or when you are like discussing perhaps with your little kiddos, o quizás cuando estamos enojados con los niños, ¿verdad? Oh, you really do stress me. Usted le dice, de veras me estresa. That happens sometimes. A veces pasa. So we emphasize por in the do, but that's specific on special cases. ¿Ok? ¿Any other question? No. No. Oh, ok. Ok, ok, ok. Let's see. We are going to right now do another exercise. And what is the exercise? Okay. We have to make a few questions. It says here that we have to create a questionnaire and ask the questions to a different classmate, writing his or her of their answers. But actually, that activity we did it yesterday. Esa actividad la hicimos ayer. Okay. Now, in page 25, we are going to ask partners questions about someone else's daily routines and say what they do or don't, okay? Now, yesterday we were working with this. Yesterday we were actually working with this. Ayer realmente estuvimos trabajando en esto. Asking people about their routine. But the questions were like very simple. Now, I need you to please start thinking. Do you remember that I asked you yesterday to bring vocabulary about your activities, your daily activities? ¿Se recuerdan que ayer les pedí que trajeran vocabulario específico de su trabajo? Do you remember? Or you don't? Se nos olvidó. Yeah, I see some faces like, mm. okay. But remember, it's what you do every day. So what are you going to do? We are not going to be asking and answering. We are going to go to the breakout room and you are going to say, okay, I attend meetings. 
I create reports. I do inventory. I have to drive. I visit clients. I meet with clients. Because when we come back, your classmates are going to answer that. I need at least five sentences. But today you are going to have just three minutes. Ahora solo vamos a tener tres minutos in the breakout room. And you are going to be in groups of three. Y vamos a estar en grupos de tres. So that means that you have to run because I need you to be speaking in English faster. And I'm going to check from room to room that you are really speaking in English. Vamos a meterle ya más velocidad a esto. It's second week. So we need to improve. We need to make the effort. Okay? Any question? I will be moving around. Cualquier duda, voy a estar moviéndome por ahí. Okay? Don't worry. This is easy because you are just going to talk about what you do. Like Mayra says, oh, I am an accountant. I keep track of financial reports, perhaps. I help people with their accounts. I check uh, incomes and outcomes. You see? Specific. Be specific. Ready, guys? Entendemos la actividad? Okay, let's see. The groups are created. Hi. Please join in. Sí, a Diego, díganle. Vamos ya. Jenny, necesita ir al grupo. Hola, hola, hola. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Sorry. No problem, no problem. Mayra, are you having problem? It appears here that Jenny, are you connecting already to the group? Se está conectando al grupo? Uh, uh, yes, I am connected, pero who do I work in? Uh, supposedly you are working with, let's see, let's see. Yeah, you don't, you don't appear, you are working with Julio. With Julio, no. Okay. Don't see. Sí, sí, no, no lo veo. Le dio unirse al grupo. Sí, le di entrar. Okay, let me see. La voy a mover. Okay. Customer visit. Custom visit. Visit customers. Visit ah. customer. Visit. Okay, este, the delivery también. Y, y cotizaciones. No sé cómo sería. Ready. Okay. Maybe. Mm. The agents in oh, oh, ready uh, 18 right. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh, hoy, hoy en cuarentena mm, prácticamente <laughs> salimos a domicilio. ¿Cómo nos mandan a domicilio? ¿Cómo se puede decir domicilio? Servicio a domicilio. Servicio al cliente a domicilio. Uh, delivery service. 
Ajá, de libre, de libre, ajá. Uh -huh. eh, eso no tenemos hora, es específica, puede ser mañana o tarde, no, depende de, el cliente lo pide. Okay. Eso no, no tenemos ahorita por cuarentena, no tenemos específico. Ok, ok, ok. Pues, Ana, eh, residence service. Residence, residence, residence. Residence Service. Service. Okay. Service. Yes. Okay. Eh, eso es lo que me hace no poder tener hoy en día un, un horario específico por este, este problema de la de, de COVID. No tenemos ahorita qué. Tenemos o nos quedamos o salimos. O sea, Try to use hotel. The English. Okay. <ríe> Liliana, tú le preguntas a Marcos, you don't need to well, you, you just need to say the sentence. Oigo. What teacher? You don't actually need to, to, to make the question. Just say, okay, me. I do this, I do this, and I do this. No necesitan este, hacer preguntas. Solo directo. A decir la actividad. Okay, what you do. Okay, perfect. Marcos, you too. Ok. Este. Word for STV computer. Computer. Eh, I work in computer support company. Eh, support software. Eh, 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 instala is, is, eh, is, bueno, installation software install 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 eh, software este eh, install install in electrical eh, eh, install cámara security Security eh, cameras, security cameras. Okay. Security cameras. Te orina. <risa> Uy. Ay, okay. no. Mejor okay. aclarar. Erika. Uh -huh. okay. Erika, um, your turn. Ok, I check the emails on Monday. On Monday. Yes. And um, Thursday. Check the arrivals. Check the arrivals. arrivals. Uh, with, uh, what? On Wednesday. Uh, Revisar Wednesday. las llegadas de los clientes. Mm -hmm. The clients. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, arrivals. Arrivals. Huh? Yes. Arrivals. Arrivals. Arri arrivals. The clients. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ok. Ok, en un minuto, we go back. Ok, ok. Thanks. The I can with form. Okay, everybody's almost back. Hey guys, I if you check the chat, I wrote something for you. Price quotation, price quotation. 
that's cotización. Not pricing. Also, but the most formal is price quotation. Price quotation. Okay. Yes. Like, the thing is this, that if I uh, imagine that, uh, that I ask Vicente to do, uh, to provide a service for me and I tell him, hey, please Vicente, I need to know uh, everything, the materials, how much you are going to charge me. I mean, what's going to be your fee your fee, ah, honorarios, okay? So materials okay. plus Vicente's fee, he write it on a paper, on a piece of paper, or perhaps he sends me an email that's going to be a price quotation. Eso va a ser una cotización because it will include everything, detail, okay? That's price quotation. ¿Cómo se escribe, teacher? Which one? Quotation. Price. Price is quotation. Or imagine that, uh, let's see, who else works for Valdez? Que más trabaja en Valdez? I remember there's more than. Lito. I'm sorry? Julito. Okay, Julio. Imagine that I need a, an equipment. And I ask Julio, eh, Julio, please, can you send me a price quotation for an equipment for my, I need three machines for my company. And I send him the specs. I send him the specifications. Specifications, you can say it short, sex. Okay. I send him the specs and he tells me, okay, today in the afternoon, I will send you by an email the price quotation. Y él me dice, ah, okay, me manda la información y hoy por la tarde yo le envío por medio de un correo the price quotation, la cotización. You see? Price quotation. In this case, it's different. It's not pricing. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, before we continue, guys, I'm sorry, I need to do the my homework, that is the attendance. Let's see, Carlos Alberto. Present. Thank you. Mayra Eliana. Where's Mayra? Mayra Eliana Corles. Present. Thank you. Ana Maria Palacios. Present. Thank you. Uh, Maybelline Michelle Martinez. Oh no, she's not going to continue. She told me. Erika de Carmen Colocho. I saw Erika around. Erika estaba por aquí. Yes, in, in our group. She was in the group. Yes, it's true. Let's see. Is she still there? No, she's not. Perhaps she has yes, problems. Here. Perhaps she has problems. Uh, Jennifer Elizabeth? Present. Thank you. Jose Reinaldo, oh, he connected yesterday. Claudia Patricia. And Claudia is having problems connecting. Andres Alberto. Present. Thank you. Cesar Humberto Lopez. Present. Thank you. Jenny Lisette Escobar de Orellana. Present. Thanks. Vicente Alexander Reyes. Present. Daniel Arturo Montes Medrano. 
Hey, Daniel is missing. Ah, oh, that's weird. Mayra Lisette Valladares. Present. Thank you. Marcos Ivan Martinez Garcia. Present teacher. teacher. Thank you. Maybelline Janira Aguilar de Rodesno. Oh, she's not here. Carla Ibon Bolaños Aviles. Present, present. Thank you. Julio Alonso Duran. Present. Thank you very much. Okay, let's continue. Now, Cesar, tell me. Tell me about yes. one of your classmates. Okay. Uh, I talk about Jenny. I talk to Jenny. Oh, I I, to oh okay. Jenny. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Cesar. I will talk about Jenny. Hablaré. That's what you mean? Oh, okay. I will talk about Jenny. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Talk. Talk. Remember, when you say, when you have a word, like in this case, talk. L before K. L antes de K. The L no sound. Okay? Talk. Ah, okay. La L antes de K. No tiene sonido. Okay. Okay. So you say talk. Okay. Walk. Okay. Um, Please talk. continue. Okay. Uh, Jenny sells and ser a service and flower analyzer equipment. 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 Perfect. Yes. And she attend to clients on Central America and the Caribbean. Oh, great. And, and she make uh, many emails. Okay. Every day. She sends, perhaps? She sends emails? Sends email. Okay, remember, you sends, you send email. Uno okay. envía email. Send emails. Okay? Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Now let's see. Okay. Jenny, tell me. I will oh. talk about Cesar. Uh, he works in sales industrial equipment. Okay. He have he has meeting. he has meeting with his clients. Okay. He makes a price quotation quotation. <laughs> Quotation. Quotation. He makes a price quotation every day. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Thank you. Let's see now, Jennifer. Hello. Hello, Jennifer. Tell me about one of your classmates. Quotation. I talk with Carla. Okay, tell me about Carla. She prepare equipment. Okay. She work in Valdez store SRC. Okay. She she receive merch. No sé cómo se Merchandise. 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 Y she do the inventory. And she do she does inventory. And she, she does. does Okay, great, excellent. Carla, please. Um, Jennifer to do industrial engineer. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Jennifer is an industrial engineer. Okay. Jennifer is industrial engineer. I'm sorry, she I'm sorry, sorry, does... sorry. She's an, an. She is an industrial. She is or she No, it's oh, okay. She is, but you need to say it like this. Look at the chat, please. She is an. Look at the chat. She is 
an industrial engineer. Okay. She okay. is an industrial engineer. She does inspection. Okay. She does meeting and she does training. Okay, perfect. Actually, uh, well, she does the training or she attends or receives training? Attends. Attends trainings. Assiste, yeah. Okay? Okay. If I do the training, it means that I am the trainer. Okay? You see what I mean? If I do the okay. training, if I do the training, it means that I am the trainer. Si yo do the training, quiere decir que yo soy el que hace la capacitación, da la capacitación. If not, I attend trainings. You see the difference? Yes? Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now, let's see. Eliana, please, tell me. Teacher, yo no noté lo de mis compañeros. Do you remember anything? Uh, Vicente, he organized. Organized. Organized work for others. Okay, perfect. Only remember, Marcos uh, installa cámaras de seguridad. Was Installs. 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 Security, security. cameras. Okay, perfect. Just mm -hmm. listen to me. Cameras. Camera. Cameras. 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 Yes, like that. Perfect. Cameras. Okay. Remember, it's not cameras. It's not cameras. It's cameras. Cameras. That sound comes from here. Ese sonido viene de acá. Okay. It's not A, it's not E. No es el sonido de A, pero tampoco es el de E. It's a mix. It's cameras. Cameras. You are pushing air out here. Ke, cameras, okay? Cameras. Perfect, thank you. Marcos, please tell me. Hi. Uh, I work in Vicente Iliana. Okay. Tell me about uh, Iliana. Iliana is Manicurista. Manicurist. Eh, ma manicurist. In hotel. Hotel. Eh, hotel. In oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Listen to me. Hotel. Hotel. Hotel, perfect. Eh, in hotel. Um, Vicente, he drive a motocicleta, motocicle. Motorcycle. Okay. Motorcycle. And to delivery eh, eh, cotizaciones, como dijo que, es, que se Price mencionaba. Price quotation. Okay. Price quotation and visit project 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 eh, in market eh, eh, project eh, eso me recuerdo teacher okay excellent that's great that's great so let's see uh, Anna please tell me I I qui Andres Alberto okay tell me about Andres at Clay. Okay, at some clients. Uh, at Clay. Uh, you send email. Okay, email. Send, send emails. Send, you send email. Well, uh, listen, listen. He sends emails. He send email. Email. Okay. Yes, perfect. Uh, Assistant eh, Gerencia Management 
Assist, eh, assistant manager gerencia. Management eh. means gerencia. La palabra management quiere decir gerencia. Management. Um, okay. Eh, sí. Ok, thank um. you. Thank you, Ana. Now, let's see, uh, Carlos, please. Yes, I'm, uh, uh, Carla. Okay, tell me about uh, Carla. She's on Valdez. Okay. Uh, she does equipment. Okay. She does inventory. 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 Perfect. She does receive. Okay. Excellent. She That's enough. Mer mer merchandise. 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 Okay. Perfect. Thank you very much. Julio. Hello, teacher. Hello. Tell me about somebody. Uh, I didn't listen, teacher. Okay, no problem, no problem. What about you, Mayra? I work with Ana Palacios and okay. Andres. Okay, tell me about Ana. Okay. She start work at 8 a.m. A.m., perfect. She work, she work in resident service okay. and she work with client agent okay perfect thank you very much thank very specific andres please you haven't participated i teach tell me about any of your classmates uh, okay uh, Eh, Ana eh, with service eh, residential in okay. in, in, you, in 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 your work hair and, work hair work and hair work yes no mine <laughs> yes okay. eh, I'm sorry Andres I'm sorry a better way to say it una mejor manera de decirlo in her job Okay. When you say in her, my, you can say in my work, you refer to the, to everything. But when you say in my job, you are talking about your position. Okay. Please continue. Okay. Era de cualquiera de la clase. Yes. Okay. And... Carlas is working in Valdez okay. and para decir igual. Okay. Carla and, bueno, Carlas and you and, and Julio, they are working in Valdez. Okay. Stop just a second. If you, say, if you say Carla and Julio, you don't need to say they. You say Carla and Julio work in Valdez. Okay. okay. Because remember, Usted puede usar eh, nombre o pronombre, but never both, pero no al mismo tiempo. ¿Ok? Uh, ok. No. Thank you very much. Ok. Thank you. That's enough. That's enough. Relax. No problem. Ok, guys. Let's see. Let's go back to the material. Ok. Now, let's see. Assistance. It says here, does Antonio ask for assistance every morning? Okay, do you know what's that word, assistance? Like imagine, uh, imagine you are working in your office and your computer bro breaks down and there's somebody in charge of helping you with the computer. So you call for assistance. 
imagínense que usted trabaja y se le arruina la máquina en la oficina. But you are not authorized to be like checking. Pero no está autorizado para atravesar. So you call for assistance. Usted llama por uh, ayuda. Ok. In this case, could be for tech support. Technological support. Short tech support. You don't say, we don't say technological support. We say tech support. Okay? That's the way we, we are going to say tech support. Okay? That's short for technological support. Okay, let's see. Uh, Cesar, tell me, do you usually ask for assistance? Uh, repeat, please. Do you usually ask for assistance in your company? Yes, I do. Why? Tell me, what type of assistance? Uh, for the computers okay or for the uh, the technicals uh, technicals of ma machinery machinery or oh, the techniques uh, machinery techniques techniques or mach technicians. Uh, of the machine technicians technicians oh, okay. yes yes Technicians, uh, the machinery uh, of the clients. Okay, perfect. Oh, so you refer, you refer the tech support, or in this case, the technician, because not the technological, the technicians for the clients. Oh, that's yes. different because you refer. So you have to be like, you are like an intermediary between the client yes. and, the, and the technicians, and the, perfect. And the technicians. Remember, in this case, it's not tech support because it's technicians, not technological. Okay? So he... Como se, como se escribe? What? Technicians. Mm. Technicians. Like that. Como se escribe? With a C. Technician. Like with... Ah, okay. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. So let's see. Uh, what about you, Carla? Do you ask for assistance in your job? Do you usually do it? Yes. Man, man, mantenimiento sería mantenition of the of okay. system. Maintenance. 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 Maintenance of system. Of system. Maintenance of the system. Of the system, yes. Okay, now, look at me, Carla. Of, of. Do you remember from when we were spelling? ¿Se acuerdan cuando estábamos deletreando? If you say O-F, you pronounce it as a V. Si decimos O-F, nada más, se pronuncia of. Okay, if you say off, what you are talking about is like the light turn off, como en la luz. So in this case, it's off. Okay, let's see. What about you, Mayra? Do you ask for assistance in your job? Yes, usually. Okay, why? What, uh, what type of problems? Uh, arise uh, maintenance of system okay do they uh, the system 
do problems with the systems arise regularly? Oh, do you know that word, guys? ¿Conocen esa palabra? Arise. Surgen. Surgen. Okay. Mm -hmm. Usually it talks about uh, levantamiento. No, that's rising. Levantarse, arise. But in this case, when we talk about problem, uh, we say that some situations arise. It means surgen. Okay. Thank you. Now, let's okay. see. Let's go back to the book. Okay. Do you remember, guys? Yes, no questions. In this case, when we are talking about the third person, does she ask for assistance? Does he drive the truck on weekends? Does Selena make phone calls? Does our company check the policies? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Okay, policies. In this case, look, the exercise five says pair word, create a question based on the answer. Okay, guys, do you have your manuals? Yes. Yes? Okay, perfect. We are going to work in page 26, exercise five. I'm going to take you to the breakout rooms. You're going to work in pairs and you have to create the questions for according to the answer that appears. I'm going to take you to the breakout room. Los llevaré al breakout room. You are going to create a question, working in pairs, van a crear una pregunta, trabajando en pareja, according to the answer, de acuerdo a la respuesta, that appears there, la respuesta que aparece ahí. So that's what we are going to do right now. I'm going to take you to the breakout rooms, you are going to read everything, and you are going to create a question for each answer that appears there. Okay, ready? Yes? Ready. Perfect. Yes. Perfect, perfect. I know you are tired guys, but today we are, we are working pretty fast actually. Hoy vamos trabajando muy rápido. Let's see, I'm going to recreate all the sections. And let me see. Perfect. Please go to the rooms. Ajá. En la página 26. Ajá. Page 26. Okay. Eh, number, number 5. Okay. Eh, middle number 5. All right. Ask. Okay. Voy a revisar el manual, permítame. Mm. Eh, in the page Okay. In, page, in page 26, in, exercise in page, 5. Okay, in page 8. Mm -hmm. okay. Exercise 5. Donde dice unit 1. Page 26. No, unit, unit 2. Unit 2. Exercise 5, okay. pair work. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, I'll be back. Eh, aquí, yo ya las tengo. Aquí. Hello.
Do you have the manual? Teacher. Yes. Eh, no, yes. No, no encontramos la, la, la página del libro para la actividad. Okay, it's this. Look. No me carga. Can you see it? La pueden ver. Yes. Pero necesitamos tenerla. Ahorita le tomo captura. Pero... Okay, you can do that. You can take a screenshot. Pueden tomarle una captura. Listo. Okay, then you can share it with Marcos here. Usted se la puede compartir a Marcos acá. Okay, la captura. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll be back. Vuelvo. Gracias. You're welcome. Sí. Ya no sería un Friday. No. Esa ya es la respuesta. And to answer is answers. Yes. Answer. No. Look at me. Look at me. Answer. 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 Perfect. Okay. To answer, answer is she's, yes, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Ahora la cuarta pregunta sería, does Eric keep drop on the cells? Jenny, question Mande. number four. Sí, das. Try Eric. to use English, try to use English. Usemos más inglés. You can do it. I know you can do it. Yo sé que sí puede. ¿Cómo sería? O sea, la pregunta es, does Eric keeps track on the cells? Yes, yes, Esa, yes. esa es la pregunta. Así se pronuncia. Number Number four. Number four. Does Eric keep yes. Does Eric keep track on the cells? Does Eric keeps track on the cells? Look at me. Keep. Mm -hmm. No es keep. Recuérdese, como keeps. ya llevamos el das, la s del keep desaparece. Ay, se quita. Es cierto. Es cierto. Perdón. And Jenny. Does Eric keep track on the cells? Perfect. And remember, Jenny. Entonces, en la, en la tree es, does she clean? She yes. clean the first floor only. Okay, no clean. perfect. She sent. <laughs> Cierto. Sorry, perfect. me he olvidado. Jenny, listen to me. You know, <laughs> you know more English. You can speak more <laughs> in English. I know, okay. I've been hearing you. Eh, usted ya ha estudiado inglés. Le he escuchado presente perfecto. So, you know how to you speak more. Try to do it. Try to do it. <laughs> It's like Ileana. I know that Ileana understands more because I can listen that your level of English is not quite bas basic. Puedo escuchar que el nivel de inglés de ustedes dos no es tan básico. So when we get into these groups, try to... Oh, no, teacher. No way. <laughs> you... yeah, pronunci pronunciation. Oh, um... yes. But that's a matter of practice. Pero eso simplemente es a través de la práctica. <laughs> so try okay. to use it. Try to use it. My... Es que en la empresa se le llama servicio varios, pero no sé. Auxiliaries? Auxiliar. Auxiliaries. You finished, guys? Yes. Okay, we're going back to the main room.
is off. My microphone was off. Now, no problem. Okay, let's see. Uh, Carla, tell me question number one. Okay, question number one. Does he fix the AC on Friday? Okay, what is AC, Carla? Air conditioner. Oh, thank you. Air conditioner. Oh, Cesar is helping you. Air conditioner. Oh, come on, <laughs> come on, come on. You know what? That's cheating. Sorry. No problem, no problem. That's cheating. Eso es darse copia. Cheating. Oh, actually, that word cheating? Uh, more complex, also means engañar, okay? So imagine that you are uh, in a couple with somebody, imagínese que usted está en pareja, and you cheat on that person, it means that you have somebody else, okay? So that, that word can be used in different contexts. Se utiliza en diferentes contextos. In this case, when they helped Carla, they were cheating in the class. You see, it's a different context. Okay, thank you, Carla. The verb, the verb no es. Right? Exactly. Right, because we got the auxiliary right at the beginning. That's why you say, does he fix the AC on Friday? Yes, he does. He fixes the AC on Friday. Okay, number two, let's see. Tell me, Carla, who were you working with? Caesar. Okay, so Caesar, I'm sorry, you are not going to participate right now. Jennifer, number two, Hello. please. Let me. Do, does, ¿cómo se pronuncia el da, das? Das. Das. The secretary sent a lot of mail. The answer is, yes, yeah, she does. She sent many emails to customer. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Who were you working with? Julio. Okay, so Julio cannot participate right now. I'm sorry, Julio. Let's see, Vicente. Number three, Hello. please. Does Kiliana clean all building? Building. 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 The answer, please. No, she doesn't. She cleans the first floor only. Okay, she cleans the first floor only. The first floor only. Perfect. Let's see. The first floor only. Perfect. Who were you working with, Vicente? With Carlos, no? With Carlos, yes. Perfect. So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Jenny, number four. Does Eric keep track of the cells? Okay. Please, the answer. Yes, he does. Eric? Eric keep trap on the cells. Okay, in the answer, yes, you need the S. Eric keeps track on the cells. Remember, okay. remember guys, when we are saying the question, as we get the auxiliary, the S disappear. But in the answer, the S appears back. Recuérdense, cuando estamos haciendo la pregunta en presente simple, como tenemos el auxiliar, la S desaparece. Pero en la respuesta, it comes back. Regresa. Okay. Any question up to now? ¿Alguna pregunta hasta este momento? Yes? Repeat, please. Eso de, de la S, porfa, teacher. Ok. 
Let's see, let's see, let's see. The S. Look. Cuando hacemos la pregunta, utilizamos el auxiliar. Perdón que lo diga en español, porque es para que quede muy claro. En el presente simple, en la forma interrogativa, utilizamos el auxiliar do o das. La estructura básica nos pide que el auxiliar vaya al inicio de la oración. En el ejemplo último que teníamos, does Eric keep track on the cells? La oración afirmativa me dice a mí que el verbo keep debe de llevar una S al final del verbo, ¿verdad? Eric keeps track on the cells. En la pregunta, como tengo el auxiliar, ¿se recuerdan que normalmente el auxiliar es do? Pero cuando hablo de he, she o it, el auxiliar se convierte a das. Entonces, la S que tenía en la forma afirmativa en keeps desapareció y la retomó sobre sí el auxiliar. ¿Ok? So, in this case, the question. Does Eric keep track on sales? Yes, he keeps track on sales. Ahora sí. Solo en tercera persona lleva S. Yes. El verbo en... Si preguntamos ellos o we, nosotros, no lleva S el verbo. Exacto. You are right, Carla. Any other question? ¿Alguna otra pregunta? No. Okay, okay. Let's continue. Okay. Now. We have been asking our classmates about their routines. ¿Ok? Hemos estado hablando con los compañeros de sus rutinas. But we have been saying affirmative sentences. You tell me, oh, Cesar does this, Cesar does the other thing, uh, Jennifer attends meetings, Jennifer writes reports, Jenny sends emails, Now, we will go back to the breakout room for three minutes, but I want, when you come back, you are going to tell me, I'm going to pick three of you. Voy a escoger tres de ustedes. And those three persons are going to be volunteers, of course. Those three persons are going to tell me sentences about your classmate routine, affirmative and negative. Okay? Like... Like Jennifer uh, writes report. She doesn't visit customers. You see? One affirmative, one negative. At least three sentences. Okay? It can be one affirmative, two negatives. It could be two affirmatives, one negative. Okay? Three top. Tres como total. Ready? Okay, let's go back. Okay, but I don't have to bring anything. Okay. 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 Hey. 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 Hey.
repeat. Um, negative. I oh, say no. three. Three tops. Tres en total. Ah, okay. Can be three one top. negative, two affirmative. Okay. Like, okay. Uh, okay. Li listen to me, like the example. Uh, I prepare classes, I check exams, I, I don't go to school right now. You see? Okay. So when okay. you report about me, you say, oh, Douglas attends classes, Douglas uh, doesn't go to school. Okay. 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 Excellent. Bye. Sister. Okay. okay. I. Okay. Okay, guys, you finish? No, come on, Sabama, teacher. Okay, hurry up, hurry up. One more minute. No, two minutes. Okay. Teacher, is correct the seed say what do you do on weekday? Yes, what do you do on weekdays? Oh. En los días de la semana. But in this case, you don't need to be as asking questions. En este momento no necesitan que hacer preguntas. It's something like this. Look, uh, I teach classes, I prepare exams, I don't go okay. to school. Simple. Three mm -hmm. sentences, mm -hmm. top. Tres oraciones por todas. Okay? Okay. Continue, continue. Okay. No hace comida, no sé. Ella no hace comida. I don't cook. She, I don't cook. Or she doesn't cook. She doesn't, she doesn't cook. Remember, three sentences total. Tres oraciones en total. Oh, okay. Positive and negative. Que me, me indicó el, el teacher. Which si teacher? se usa das. Ah? Oh, you si were usa, talking about me. Si usa das, eh, no lleva, es el verbo. Does he das. pick he? Does he pick? Sin ese das. Mm -hmm. The A's on the Friday. Yeah, he does. He fights. The A's. Sí. Hello, guys. You finish? Bien. Yes. Yes. Okay. Excellent. We are going back to the main room, Jennifer. So Okay, let's see. We are back here. Well, at least some of us are. And we need to run with this exercise. Come on with this, guys. Oh, they are coming back. There's the center now. Okay, now let's see. Uh, Jennifer. Hello. Hello. Tell me your sentences, please. Um, Julio. Receive diagnostic diagnostic equip, equipment. Diagnose. Diagnostic equipment. 
He answered call. Answers. Answer call. He sent email. Email. Look at the chat. Uh, I wrote the word diagnose. Diagnose. Okay. Is solo esas son las actividades. Perfect. <laughs> Excellent. Cesar, tell me. Okay. Uh, Carla prepare equipment for processing. Equipment. Equipment for processing. Uh, she make inventory review for the daily production and she doesn't make a cleaner. She doesn't do the cleaning. Do the cleaning. Yes, ah, okay. she doesn't do the cleaning. No hace la limpieza. Oh. House. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Carla. No, no, not, not. <laughs> Look, Carla, look at this expression. Shame on you. It means, que pena. That's shame on you. Okay, guys, thank you very much. Let me just get the attendance one more time because, believe it or not, time's over. Vamos a tomar la asistencia porque lo creamos o no, se nos fue el tiempo. Okay, let's see. Carlos Alberto Menéndez. Present. Thank you. Mayra Eliana Corleto. Present. Ana Maria Palacios. Present. Present. Ok. Erika. Escucha, me escucha. Yes, Ana. Erika de Carmen. Oh, she left. And Jennifer Elizabeth Hueso. Present. Okay, Claudia didn't connect. Andres Alberto? Present. Thank you, Cesar Humberto Lopez? Present. Thank you. Jenny Lisset Escobar de Orellana? Jenny? Present. Thank you, Jenny. Vicente Alexander? Present. Thank you. Uh, Daniel Diran appear. Mayra Lisette Valladares? Present. Thank you. Marcos Ivan Martinez? Present the teacher. Maybelline Janira? Thank you. Maybelline Janira? No, she didn't connect. Carla Ivonne? Present. Thank you. Julio Alonso Duran. Present. Thank you very much. Guys, thank you very much to all of you. Uh, it was a nice class. Me encantó esta clase. It was very dynamic. We make a lot of things and we saw a lot of vocabulary. So see you tomorrow. <laughs> Try to be early. Bye bye. Have a good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good, good night. night. Bye. Good, good night, night, everybody. Bye. See you tomorrow, tomorrow. tonight.